Good morning, Side Creek. My name is Jonathan Castro. And I'm Chloe Trejo. Please stand for your morning pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. And now for a moment of silence. Want to show your love this Valentine's Day, but you just don't know what to buy your friends or teachers? Don't fear. Why? Because Tafe Club is here. Tafe Club will be selling Valentine's during all lunches for the next two weeks. Just give us your friend's name and their second or fourth period teacher, and Tafe Club will deliver your Valentine. Attention all PAL applicants. Applications are due today in room 2715 at 315. No late applications will be accepted. For any questions, please see Ms. King. On Saturday, February 13th, students will be going to the George R. Brown Convention Center to attend Career and Education Day. This is a great opportunity to talk to your potential future employees. Companies and colleges that have attended in the past offer students career information, including the FBI, cosmetology, real estate, dance, digital media, and filmmaking, and much more. The field trip is available to all grade levels. If you're interested, see Ms. McDonald in 2253 or Ms. Minier in 2325. You will need a permission slip, so don't wait till the last minute. Prom tickets will be on sale from February 3rd to February 5th. All tickets will be $80. Don't buy yours at the last minute. Cypress Creek High School Band has been offered an invitation to the Music for All National Festival in Indiana on March 9th through March 13th. They have been working hard and their performances will be held here at Cy Creek. The symphonic concert will be held on March 3rd at 7 p.m. Their percussion ensemble will be on March 7th at 7 p.m. Please support our awesome Cy Creek band. Congratulations to the CFISD Student of the Week, which is Derek Anderson. Congratulations. This week's spread winners are <laughs> Mr. Sino, and the other winner is Tajay Bars. Congratulations. Cy Creek High School was rewarded three golden footballs by the NFL for its three former students who have gone on to win Super Bowls. Samuel Adams, Cameron Fleming, and Dan Neal were all honored by Cypress Creek during a ceremony on January 26th. I come to Houston often. Uh, I am from here, and my mom does still live here, and my in-laws live here, but uh, it, it's kind of different when you come back to your high school. You know, as far as my career in football, I couldn't think of a better place to begin a career than this high school, this school district, and this city. I guess for me, the, the tangibles we talked earlier about making it to the NFL and anyone can really get there, but there's a lot of factors that are outside your control. And one of the big factors, obviously, is where you go to high school. And for me, I was very, very fortunate to go here, not only because it was great leadership at the time here with the principal on down, great high school coach, great players, just a great environment as far as being able to be a part of the school. So I really, I'm very honored to be a, a Cy Creek Cougar. These three alumni embody the true spirit of Cypress Creek and what high school athletics are all about. From Cypress Creek High School, I'm Hayden Wilkerson. Hi, I'm Eric Eastad. And I'm Gretchen Marizian. And here's what's going on at Cy Creek Sports. Girls basketball lost to Cy Fair last Tuesday night, 47 to 58. Their next home game is here tonight against Cy Falls at 7. Tonight is their pink out game and they will be taking donations at halftime for breast cancer awareness. Wear pink, pack the stands, cheer like crazy for your Lady Cougar basketball team. Girls Varsity Golf won second place in the Bear Creek Golf Tournament. Congrats to Tyler James, Kelly Swanson, Hannah Felsky, Julia Iverson, and Amanda Billings. Way to go Cougars! Boys basketball defeated Cy Fair 52-51 last Tuesday night. Cy Fair sent the game into overtime with a last second three, but Cy Creek opened it up on a 5-0 run to take the lead that they would not give back. Their next game is tonight at Cy Falls at 7 p.m. And that's it for Cy Creek Sports. I'm Eric Eastep. And I'm Gretchen DeRuzzi. Now back to the show.
Slide Creek hosted the first ever CAM Student Career Symposium on Tuesday, January 26th. Students interested in careers in the creative side of media and technology attended sessions with speakers, got advice on specific careers, and enjoyed a keynote address from Slide Creek Wall of Fame graduate Rachel McNeil from Channel 2. I want to thank everyone, especially that kid in the back on his cell phone texting, for watching this edition of This Week at Creek. My name is Jonathan Castro. And I'm Chloe Trejo. See you next week, Creek.